to show you how to install a linen chute. The equipment you're going to need for this is a spirit level, a screwdriver or drill, some drill bits, tape measure, some clamps and of course the linen chute. So the first step you'll need to do is to find the timber stud in the wall. I'm going to do this by using a stud finder. That will tell me exactly where the timbers are to hold my cabinetry firm. I've marked the left and right side of the stud and now where the centre is, I'm going to run a plumb line down. This is where I want to fix my cabinet. Because you won't be able to see these marks when your cabinet's in place, just measure across from the corner and make a note of those measurements. That way you can measure once your cabinet is in place. So just before we get started installing this cabinet, I'm going to remove the door and the basket we're inside. This is going to make the installation much easier. The first step we need to do now is to put the cabinet roughly in place and take a few measurements. I'm going to measure and just make sure that I've got enough room to fit my bench in and that everything lines up. I'm going to clamp this cabinet to my existing one. That will make everything nice and secure. And then I can fix into those two cabinets holding them together and also fix down the back wall into the stud work. Before I can actually fix the cabinet to the other one or the wall, I need to ensure that it's level and plumb. I may need to adjust the feet in order to achieve this. Once you're happy with the cabinet being plumb and level, you can now fix it to the other cabinet and to the wall at the back. Firstly, I'm going to fix through these thicker rails at the back into the wall. I'll just pre-drill a small hole and then put the screw through. And now we're going to fix into the other cabinet to hold them together. I'm just drilling a pilot hole from this side. I don't want to go right through the two cabinets. And then I'll use a screw that's short enough to just join the two but not pop out the other side. So we'll just unclamp the cabinet from the other one, clean it out, put the door back on and we're finished. And that's how you install a laundry linen chute.